Today is an important day for electric mobility. It's marking the delivery of 10 buses to the Twin Rivers Unified School District, which brings their total electric fleet up to 40 buses. Upon hearing that the Twin Rivers School District is now running the largest deployment of zero emission school buses in North America, your efforts here really demonstrate that large scale zero emission school bus fleet operations are really a way of the future and highlight the importance of bringing emission reductions to your local community and to the children that your buses serve. Congratulations again on this wonderful milestone. Many of these school buses are going to disadvantaged communities and also communities more affected by poor air quality. The Lion bus has been the Rolls Royce of school buses. And one of the nice things about Lion is their buses are built from the ground up. They're not a retrofit. It's just, you know, this is an electric product. It's, it's like a Tesla of school buses. It's been a great ride. We're gonna to continue to expand the fleet because it is the right thing to do for kids in community. And also it's an economic decision because it's less expensive to run an electric vehicle and they're more dependable and reliable. You know, the average diesel bus or combustion engine vehicle has over 2,600 parts in it. And the average electric bus has 26 moving parts in it. So the only parts we stock are light bulbs for the electric buses. At the end of the day, when you think of all the, the great electrification policies that are coming out of, of California and, and the local air agencies like, like us, it really boils down to the end user. And that is where Twin Rivers has been a great partner. They are the best spokespersons for the technology because they've seen the real benefit in terms of how it costs less to operate, it costs less to maintain, how it provides a much better ride, not only for the drivers, but also the kids and the communities where the vehicles operate. The Lion has been really generous. We received a donation to put 500 bags of groceries into people's houses. Also, we have been able to get Wi-Fi in all 10 electric buses to provide that distance learning um, opportunity for other people. We just want to say thank you to Lion and Lion has been very supportive all along the way. At Lion Electric, we will help school districts get through the process of establishing charging infrastructure, acquiring the vehicle, and integrating it with your fleet. Your fleet does not have to adjust to the electric vehicle. We will adjust to your needs. It's the time's coming when you're not gonna be able to buy a diesel bus or service a diesel bus let alone put fuel in it. I would get on board and start looking at ways to really help your community and your student population and look at all the advantages of electric and be able to reintroduce those monies you would save back into your operation or into the classroom. Building electric vehicles and feeding our community is our way of investing in the future.